Hello everyone and welcome to a very special edition of the Top 15 Plays of the Game for the month of September 2019. We had several hundred submissions this month and while not everyone can make the list, I want to thank you all for your participation. What are the rules? They are arbitrary depending on my mood, but if you make a big play at a really big time and maybe, just maybe, throw in an emote, you might make the list. The Halloween event is right around the corner so a lot of people have been practicing their photobombing skills. Be sure to subscribe if you enjoy this month's list and now without further ado, the Top 15 15 plays of the game, Photobomb Edition. Opening the list this month is DJ Stay Strong playing as Ash, defending the drum of Busan. A quick headshot on the opposing team's Ash, and the point is quickly secured. Then, while Ash is taking a moment to reload and prepare for the next fight, Lucio keeps team morale high by dropping the beat and throwing an impromptu concert, setting the mood for the list in at number 15. The number 14 spot this month goes to Ophidio, playing as Diva, pushing the payload up the hill of Rialto C. Lining up the shot, she lets Mech fly, netting four in the blast, quickly remaking to engage the cleanup, she spots Reinhardt celebrating her accomplishment, taunting the final member of Team Red as he continues to increase his objective time, pushing the payload towards the win. In at number 13 this month is Knightley, playing as Moira, advancing the payload from the start of Route 66. Team Red was over aggressive and she makes them pay. Her Kamehameha decimates all in her path as she moves forward and finishes them off. Reinhardt takes advantage of her healing to earth shatter and charge Team Red, giving him ample time to celebrate the team's success in winning the first fight and Knightley winning the number 13 spot. Number 12 this month is J May playing as Diva, attacking the tunnel of Numbani C. Red Arissa put down a fresh shield and Diva takes advantage by sending in a fresh mech bomb. The resulting explosion can catches four in the blast and weakens Orissa to the point of failure. Her teammates appreciate the effort, but Zenyatta is the only one who stops to applaud for the number 12 play by Jamey. Guildmate Narek makes the list in at number 11, playing as Reinhardt, defending the tunnel of Numbani Z. Zarya lays down the Graviton, but he doesn't think it's gonna be enough. Doubling down on Team Red, he earth shatters and crushes them on the side of the payload. An impressive display that leaves Mercy so moved, she gives it her flourish of approval to the number 11 play. That's Narek. Rounding out number 10 is a play for Moana, playing as Moira, pushing the treasure, the final meters of Junkertown C. Blasting everyone on Team Red with Kamehameha, she sweeps through the left flank and back around to the front of the payload, where she shifts from draining everyone and giving Soldier 76 a boost to help him knock out a quick set of push-ups. It's good to unwind with some light calisthenics after a mission, and it's good to see a mission succeed for the number 10 play. The number 9 play this month is from Black Magic playing as McCree, defending the first push of Junkertown A. Climbing up the left side stairs, he calls out Team Red at the stroke of noon and takes out three. Dropping in, he finishes off May for four and gives a tip of a hat to respect the fallen. Floating from the sky comes the Angel of Mercy who performs a ritual of respect of her own, blessing this play in at number 9. Avia playing as Diva is in at number 8, holding the gate into the sets of Hollywood B. Red Arissa drops a fresh shield and Diva backs up, calculating the space for maximum impact. Letting Mech fly is slipped through the door and catches five members of Team Red. She gives them a wave and Brigitte gives her a cheer as Avia gives herself the number 8 play. In at number 7 is Kitten Scratch That. It's Black Magic playing as Sombra, attacking the final turn of Numbani C. Pushing Team Red back around the corner, Zarya scoops them up with a Graviton and Sombra shuts them down with an EMP. Team Red gets melted down in the blink of an eye and Sombra begins her celebration dance. Joining the festivities, Zarya and the team all get into the act as the payload advances forward to the number 7 play. Our number 6 play is Sweet Cheeks playing as Diva on the other side, defending the final turn of Numbani C. Bomb ready, she pops Red Diva from her mech and lets her own mech fly. Catching three from Team Red in the explosion, remeching she wastes no time, continuing the dance party vibe on Numbani's final turn. And Moira expresses her gratitude with a deep bow of respect for the number six play, Sweet Cheeks. Fluffy Duck enters the list in at number five, playing as May, defending the choke of Junkertown A. Team Red is attempting a wedge bust, so May throws out her blizzard and begins taking them out in turn. Baptiste, Twinkle Toes, Symmetra, and Zenyatta get frostbit, leaving plenty of time for May to get down. And Winston to monkey around as the cleanup ensues and Fluffy Duck secures the number five play. Back on the list is Black Mage playing as Diva, holding the top of the hill of Rialto C. Guns fully blazing, she dives past Team Red's amplification matrix and rocks the back line. Bomb suddenly ready, she pops mech and allows Red Reinhardt to push it into the rest of his team around the payload. The quintuple kill is enough for all of the defending team to take a break and await the next fight for the number four spot. Number three on the list this month is Going In Raw, playing as Reaper, attacking the village of Nepal. Wraithing into the back line of Team Red, he opens up his Death Blossom and catches five of them off guard. Being knocked into the air only makes it look more dramatic in the kill feed. As Reaper lands, he expresses his disdain for Team Red, while Moira expresses her respect for his ability to take the number three play. And at number two is Spaghetti, back on the list, playing as Hanzo, attacking the second point of Lunar Colony. Walking in the front door, Hanzo hears Zarya's grab go out. Turning to spot the enemy, he launches his drag 
Dragons through the group to the high ground. The quintuple kill is all they need to take the point as everyone circles up around Hanzo and begins to dance. With this many photo bombers, it's tough not to make this the number two play. And finally, ladies and gentlemen, the number one photo bomb of the month goes to Mira Ruka playing as Diva, defending the hill of Rialto C. Mech ready, she launches her bomb down the incline and through the immortality field, taking it out with her pistol. The quintuple kill makes her jump for joy and wins to sit down and Soldier 76 bring out his Karate Kid drum. That's three emotes total, making this this month's number one play of the game for the month of September 2019. Congratulations. My friends, I hope you were entertained by this arbitrary list of plays, and if you were, then please consider sharing it with your friends. And if you really liked it, please be sure to subscribe for more content just like this. Disagree with the list? Leave a comment below and we can talk it out. To submit your own plays, upload them to your YouTube channel, leave a comment below that you have one. Feel free to check out one of my videos on the left for more right away. Until next time, however, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you again real soon.